Hey, Matthew, you might like this deal. Long ago, far away, we did a junts car at a place called Family Foods Factory Outlet. It was a lot of fun. It was a great place. I love that place, actually. I miss it a lot. This place is like a discount and salvage grocery store. It's like a last chance for groceries. A lot of food service stuff, stuff that's been pulled off shelves due to just market changes. They also have convenience store poles, which are goods from convenience stores that are past date. They sell them here for way cheap. The owners, of course, quickly found our video and said, hey, this was great. And then you guys even have like revisited it before it closed. Yeah, every time I, I came local, in, they, were, they greeted me. Like, yes, me name, too. So. They were nice. John has learned that in this very inconspicuous location. <laughs> it was which, very hard to find. You should have heard us screaming at each other in the car about it. It's like a speakeasy. <laughs> Google does definitely not know where it is. This is where it is, like in the middle of nowhere. So, there's a cop out front that deterred us. Yeah, we, we pulled into an empty parking lot in Fall River with a cop just sitting there. And we, and we like turned away and drove off. Is somebody loading up a chair? Yep. This is Brand the kind of place mind. this is. It's only open on Saturdays and Sundays from 10 to 2. Oh my god, is it closed? Are what we... time is it? 2.30. God. <laughs> I mean, unless the time's wrong, we can go check. It is open. Yeah, well anyway, the place is now called the Snack Factory. Look, it's a haunted house. What the? <laughs> Where are we? <laughs> Maybe he'll give us a tour. Please explain to me what the spinning wheel over there is, that game that they're playing. So they do some kind of like uh, promo here where if you keep your receipts and come in, you can change them in for tickets and then get prizes. Okay. It's very like 1980s supermarket <laughs> I had a nightmare like this once. <laughs> Did John just turn and run? Yeah, he sold our kidneys and mail. I mean, I gotta be honest with you, I think it's the exact same place. I think so too. I mean, it looks like the same layout and everything. This is a little spooky. <laughs> I'm not going in. They're playing music and they got lights going. I thought that maybe because we had established such a great rapport with Mike last time. Of course. If he was there and we showed up, even though it was close, he would still yeah. let us showcase. I would love to shop here, but we can't. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't need to go any further. So, what do you think, John? One of our more interesting trips. I am baffled. <laughs> <laughs> or, I really love the old store. And it's the, same, it's the store. same store. We really see it behind the curtain today. But they do have a cafe today. outdoor seating area right here. 10 to 2, Saturday and Sunday? It's a weird uh, business. I mean, I, I understand if you want to do weekends. We were hoping to talk to him. I was hoping to like, I was going to probably enjoy in there. It. But you got so if chicken you want to go in there and, and get arrested by the cops sitting up there. Do I got to go in there and yell, hey, is anybody here? That's what Matt somebody? repeatedly asked if he would do. And I didn't respond. Look, if one of you wants to go in and rile up some, some associates. Some are you afraid? Have him boot up are you the store. Afraid? Like he's got to flip a giant <laughs> switch and turn all the lights Look, on. I, I don't want any trouble of any kind. Are you some kind of law? Are you some kind of law? John wants to keep his record <laughs> clean. He's made it this far without getting arrested. We should go ask the cop. What, why, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you, yeah, what are you guarding? And apparently Snap nothing. We waltzed easy. right in. You failed the penetration test. <laughs> <laughs> Where have you brought us to? So uh, this place I've never been before. It's called Creative Auctions. And it's in Fall River. I think it's in the same spirit as that other place we used to like, which was the Family Foods and Grocery Outlet. Didn't we try to get to a new version of that recently? We did. Maybe 10 minutes ago? Maybe 10 minutes ago. It didn't work out so well. It's very interesting. Because it closed at two. This place is open till a bounty six. Look, and they got more than food, my man. They got yeah. brand name clothing. Clothing, supposedly. They Furniture, have those big electronics, toys. cases. Stereos, VCRs, toys. Let's see what we got. The store is definitely open. It does indeed strike me as what you thought it was. Yes, mill basement kind of version of that, which I am fine with, because it's gonna be cheap prices and better values for me. It's kind of nice and toasty in here too. I like it. I'm getting that building 19 vibe. Did you expect to see kitchen supplies? I did not. They have a real great variety of stuff here. Oh, okay. Cake holder in the market for a good cake container. For your veggies? Delicious. I am so appealed to making my own like TV dinner. For seven dollars, you get that, 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 but not that, that, or that. <laughs> yes. I love it. <laughs> I actually do love it. Are there any checks or X's on this one? I think no, I see the whole thing. You get the whole set for fifteen bucks. And you can get your like diapers and paper towels here. The door had a sign that said fifty percent off all Christmas items. What's the conversion? Is seventy five percent off all Halloween? Further back, the holiday, the yeah. more percent. You got to do an Excel formula so by the day. Last Christmas stuff is 100% off. Yes. They have ones that have ones missing, and they're cheaper. <laughs> but this is like 50 cents less. You're like, maybe I just want the, the pack maybe of five. Just want five. Do you guys even want to see the mac and cheese section? Oh, do you even care? And 
18 pack. I've never seen an 18 pack of craft. So I've been trying to do less gluten stuff lately, ever since this. It's garbage, it's no good, don't buy it. <laughs> 29 cents for a can of Campbell's soup is a good price. Yeah. Solid. I've been eating chicken gnocchi soup for dinners, and I recommend. I buy these by the bucket full because I, I put them in my yogurt bowls. Uh, $2.99. $2.99? But expired in January of 2021. So what? It's probably it's fine. My favorite DeSesso pasta for a buck. Are you in love? I... Do you have hearts in your eyes? Is this a Valentine's Day episode? Put that filter on me right now. <laughs> For 6.50, you, look, get, yeah, you, get, you get some. <laughs> yeah. Hey, look, you don't want to eat all of them anyway. Why didn't they put X's on those and check marks on those and don't get it? It's a huge box. Oh no, it's, it's two taped together and it's, it's four bucks, which is a great price. Quite a variety of like canned soda that you can take out with it. A lot of the packages here are resealed. Great prices. But if you have trust issues, this might not be the place for you. Yeah, look at that food service pack. I would never buy it. But it's one single packet. 25 bucks. 10 pounds. Wow. What a hunk of hunk of cheese. <laughs> look, there's a kind of a porn area. Oh, wow. This must be what they meant about like clothes and stuff. You get some Christmas trees. Gloria and I could do a haunted house this time of year. Ooh, premium ramen. Butternut squash crackers may be the weirdest thing I've ever heard. On the entrance door outside, it said all Christmas items are 50% off. But if you look, 10% off. So what? does that mean, is it in addition I, I to the 50% that, off, or no, is this an exemption? I it's just 50, and that's an out-of-date signage. This is very much in the spirit of Building 19. Like, we got goods. So you want them, talk to us. Yeah, yard sale store. Hey, John, this thing's a little noisy. Let's give it a little push, it'll be fine. Oh, the, you push it and it gets quieter? You get yourself a cross-cut shredder? I don't need one. Bending oots. Bending oots. Folding exercise bike. So you can, you know, if you wanted to exercise upstairs, you just wanted to move it around. DJ equipment? You could get started here. It basically has everything you need. You know how much this is? A dollar. <gasps> and look, two. It's a double. Hey, Matthew, <laughs> you might like this deal. It's gluten-free and a dollar. A buck for that much gluten-free food. You're gonna have to say yes. And get snack rid of those Cheerios. Get rid of your Why do I have to cheat? Get it out of your life. It's a dollar. I don't even like checks. I'm considering buying some. Cinnamon and honey nut. I'm buying mystery tomatoes. I don't even know how much they are. Oh, look, look at you. You're loading up. What's mystery about it? It says dice and it's tomatoes. What's the... Oh, you really are considering it. It's for a buck. A... You think the cheese cauliflower Maybe crackers all... are any good? They're $3 <laughs> for a pretty big box. You want me to get some? Sure. For three bucks, Nina. Do you need a cart? Would you like to upgrade to cart status, Nina? Yeah. Look, carts available. No coin bullshit. I want my own cart too. I was gonna offer Nina mine. This one. place is popular. All three of them have carts. At these prices, we can all afford our own cart. You're gonna come back here? I'm gonna come back here on a I, reg. I don't want you buying cheap junk. This is bigger than BJ's packaging. This is a 250 pack of freeze pop. But how out of What's date the catch? How many is it missing? John has the vapors. I wonder how cheap that fainting couch was. Maybe we can find a fan. <laughs> a few fans and a fainting couch for only a buck. Pop tarts on the back wall are a buck. What are we looking at? I don't know if you need these like plastic. I don't know how much they are. I don't know why they're here. I've never done a Jun's cart before where so many people involved were trying to capture my attention about the thing they found. <laughs> this $50 four-in-one table supports table tennis, billiards, and axe throwing. <laughs> what? The first two I was I was with you. And then? A little air hockey table, it would be fun. To avoid mistakes at the end of the night, all items must be paid for before taking them out of the building. Thank you. Well, obviously. I would think that would be. Is that aimed at somebody else besides the customer? Pay as you exit? Isn't that what the customers were doing already? Kind of, I guess. Shut up. Some of our food have passed their best by dates and some may have lost their nutritional value, but they are still sound. Sound. Lost their nutritional value. Did they ever have any? What I got them is a light dinner. You a know, light dinner, a dollar of checks. <laughs> not a dollar's worth. I could not eat it. Positively, no admittance. Once this dude gets a cart when he didn't expect to get a cart, that's how you know he's happy as a pig and shit. <laughs> I am. Any deals in here? No, this trash. <laughs> Look, this Maybe. trash is 50 cents. Is it though? <laughs> Only this area is mine. Oh, okay, true. I know you get a little Carvel. Ming Bings. Wings, nah, not in Look at all these chickens. Look at all those chickens. Who knows what it is? Is it tasty? It's chicken tendies. We hope. Oh yeah, here they are. These like 99 cent like cookies. What? These are ginger snaps. I just wanna like bake them and see what happens. Let's do it. Alright. What are you finding, John? This is a great pie. Yeah? Raw stuffed chicken breast with brie and apple. And they're a dollar a piece. They're usually like 309 at a supermarket a piece. Are those heated blankets? Good stuff, but I don't have the freezer room. Cooked chicken breast, not breaded. 
which wow. is the stuff that I love. Looks like a five or seven pounder. Damn. For twenty four ninety nine. You gotta come back. Uh, you know, our respectable toy section. So you can buy like Teddy Grahams and Icy what a, and all this a stuff. A toy that simultaneously delights and disgusts me. Oh my God, a second present pet? But how much for a present pet? I don't know. But 20. Gloria, what did you get? Present pet. How do you know what a present pet is? Uh -oh. I saw the commotion <laughs> at Nana's house. Are, I mean, are you honestly looking for a second? Only if it was that other one that she wanted. Now, most of the gimmick is that it unboxes itself. Is now what happens? Oh, something's going on in there. Something's here. happening. Oh, look. He's opening the box himself. He's trying. He's going to get out. I'm alive. The other gimmick is there's only two. There's Blossom and there's Missy and you don't know which one you get. I'm willing to bet you the reason these are here is because in store, people tried to rip open and see which one they were going to get. Yes. Big stuffed. Look. I love a good stuffed. You know me. A vibrating neck? Ooh. Vibrating neck. A neck vibrator. I like that it works good. It's right on the edge of unsellable yeah. and usable. Yes, it's like in that gray area yeah. where there's value. It's not like total junk. Right. This is very much why I loved Building 19 back in the day. Same idea. The kids shoes? Yeah, like wire shoes. This kind of place is actually perfect for child and for children. That's what I'm thinking. Disposable, cheap. I saw like a buck fifty sunglasses. Yeah. You know, I lose my sunglasses. I, I'm going to go take a look at them actually. Just making one more pass through here. How many things in life make you happier than a place like this? Not many, I tell you. <laughs> Just because there's so few places like this you left. This could never be a chain. It, it couldn't survive as no. a chain. No, it doesn't scale. The idea of it scaling has died. John's in love. Me too. You love it? I'll come back here with him anytime he wants. This is a product that I use, and this is a good price on it. Wild rice? Yes. This is what you make your rice with? Yeah, it's a good side. You like wild rice more than white rice? I like them both. I like the wild rice because it adds a little variety, yeah. and it usually comes with a little bit of seasoning too, which is really good. Oh my god. Ten bucks. Hello. You get your happy cola, your gold bears, and snake. Good night. <laughs> I would buy that, but it looks like it would be a real hassle. Tell me this, is it actually penny candy? Three cents each. Oh, there you so go. You That's could, as close as you're gonna get. When you're a kid, you could, you know, take yeah. a little selection. I love it. I love Halloween themed erasers on the tips of pencils. Well, why don't you get one for next year? You'll never see them again. No, no, we're fine. Oh, Nina, if you wanted to buy tons of scotch tape, just load up on the scotch. Oh, okay. So we got. Hmm. Definitely can taste the cauliflower, but. Nicely flavored. Yeah, nice and crispy. That's a pretty tasty. Yeah. So all of that for. 36.60. What a bargain. What a bargain. Pay as you exit. Sweet deal. 